Did you know that there is over 2.76 million confirmed cases of the COVID-19 virus? And over 194,000 people have died from it. And this pandemic is the worst we've ever seen since the Spanish flu, which occurred in 1918 and killed from 17 million to 50 million people. And the reason coronavirus' numbers seem small compared to the Spanish flu is because over the years, better social hygiene and modern medicine has helped any other virus become like the Spanish flu. But the battle is not over. So please, listen to your local government and stay inside. Limit outside activities. Please wear N95 respiratory mask and any plastic gloves. And stay at least six feet apart if you do decide to go outside. Even with government orders, young people like Gen Z's and some groups of millennials still won't think the virus will affect them. And which, in all honesty, probably wouldn't. The real problem with young people going out at these times is that they will get infected by the virus, not show any symptoms, and pass it on to someone else. It could be a kid, an old man or woman, or someone with health issues. And the coronavirus can seriously and lethally injure their life. This pandemic is a world-changing event. And surely, as a society and as the human race, we will come out of it differently than when we came in. The public will be a lot more conscious about their health and social hygiene. And world governments will have new precautions in place. So an event like this has a very thin chance of ever happening again. But still, we can't be satisfied. But we can't just relax and let modern medicine take care of everything. We have to take actions ourselves and stay inside. So we support those on the front lines every day, like police officers, nurses, doctors, who are risking their lives to help stop this virus. So please, help your fellow human beings. Minimize the risk of spreading the disease by staying inside. So please, please stay inside. You could be the difference between life or death for someone else. So please, once again, stay inside, limit outside contact, wear protective gear, and please wash your hands and stay clean. We are all in this together. Let's all come out of this pandemic as better people and as a better society. We might be separate, but certainly we are not alone. So once again, please stay inside and wash your hands. Hashtag separate but not alone.